So I love you both. This is my first convention. Welcome. Um, so I'm like super excited. Um, so far, so good. Yeah, really good. <laughs> um, I wanted to. I wanted to. I noticed that your hiatus beard is gone. So I'm thinking that something good happened in the show because you finally shaved it. So. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome anytime. <laughs> I mean, I mean, you're not depressed about Dean anymore. What's wrong with my hiatus? <laughs> no, no, I love that. I'm just saying that Sam is not depressed about Dean anymore, so you finally shaved it. I wasn't depressed. It was preoccupied. <laughs> I wasn't exactly shaving. Now, like, I get carded again. No, I don't. <laughs> but my question is, um, I just turned. <laughs> I just turned 18, so oh I'm gosh. like a baby adult now. And uh, <laughs> a baby adult. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what I'm doing. But no. <laughs> and you know what? You won't for a long time. <laughs> he still doesn't. He's like 60 or 70. So. <laughs> no, it's so mean. Anyway. Um, it's so mean. Anyway. <laughs> Um, I was wondering, um, when you guys were like my age or <laughs> in the... <laughs> um, no, I can't... Okay. <laughs> no, okay, um... I couldn't tie my shoe when I was 18. <laughs> you still can. <laughs> That's when I lost it. When you lost it. I'm so afraid of like wasting these years that I have, and I'm wondering what do you guys wish that you would have done like in your baby adult years, I'm guessing. <laughs> um, as much as I could. Um, experience life. I mean, don't, don't do things that put your life in danger, um, or crazy things, or do, I don't know. I went skydiving twice. Um, that was, I didn't need to do that twice. <laughs> One's good. None's fine. I will say that I called my mother after I landed. <laughs> um, I, you know, I moved to California when I was 18 years old by myself. Me too. And yeah, me too. Uh, lived in an apartment by myself and paid my own bills. And I had to grow up pretty quick. Uh, Same. And I, I would say that I, I don't regret that. Um, and I'm, I'm glad that, that it you know, went the way it did. Um, but a lot of my friends went off to college and they didn't have the experience that I did. And I think that when they were done with college, now, you know, four or even five years later, uh, then they were in the position that I was when I was 18. And I was like, oh, guys, I've been, I've been knocking it out for four or five years now. Like, they're like, can we come sleep on your couch? <laughs> so I would say whatever your path is, make sure that you're, uh, Make sure that you're, you're, you're moving towards a place that you want to be, uh, but also enjoying your life because it's, those, are, those are some fun years. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'll echo that and I'll say a little bit. Also, don't post anything that could come back to haunt you. <laughs> <laughs> we, were, we were lucky. We didn't have that this problem. Was we were, Twitter or yeah, Twitter. Don't Instagram post anything that's going to come back and haunt you. Yeah, I, I would say to try and simplify the way I feel, I would say let this one question be the, um, the boss of whether or not you do or don't do something. Um, if it's going to hurt you or somebody else, don't do it. If not, do it. Try it. Eat it. Taste it. Visit it. Look, go everywhere. Make friends. And talk to people. Open up. It's better to have loved and loved. You know, like I have friends, we sort of call it cutting the fat. Like when you, you have this whole group of friends and some are sort of just acquaintances and you know, you work with some others and then you start dating or whatever and some kind of fall away. You get engaged, some more fall away, you get married, you have kids, a lot fall away. But I'm so much more enriched as a person that I had these friends. We went different directions, but it wasn't, I'm not sad that I had it. I, I'd have been more, I wouldn't have known, but I've been more, uh, I've been less of a person if I wasn't enriched by these experiences. So if you have a chance to do something and it's not going to hurt you or somebody else, 
Do it. Yeah, I also, like, you guys have inspired me. I really want to become an actress, but I'm really scared really? about like moving out to California or something right. and starving or whatever. You know what? So was I. <laughs> and I, I remember the one thing, the one thought that, that really kind of put me over the edge and, and got me to pack up my truck and drive west. And that was, I don't want to wonder what could have what could have happened. And so, if, if you think that that might come back to, to bite you, go try it. Thank and you. And then you'll know, one way or the other. Yeah, cool. Guys, we're going to take off.